Following is a list of items that you need to laminate a photo onto the back of an acrylic sheet. A sharp knife, your image printed on polypropylene paper, which gives better results than photo paper, as photo paper has a slight texture and leaves a little bit of silver in. Your pressure sensitive laminate, cut to size, isopropanol cleaner and a lint free rag desktop laminator. For this demonstration we're using a 5mm 12 by 16 acrylic which has diamond polished edges and four 10mm drill holes for the standoffs. And finally carrier board. Right, step one we're going to put the pressure sensitive laminate onto the face of the image. You need to peel back about half an inch of the release liner on one side. You just put a crease in it. Flip that over. board the rollers on the laminator are being set to the depth of the carrier board just feed that through and up over there once again just keeping everything Clean as a little speck of dust. I'll show up like a saw thumb. Reach under and peel back. The release liner. Peel back the release liner as you come off. Now we've got it, the laminate stuck onto the, onto the image, we're going to trim up the three sides and leave the inch and a half on the top, which I'll explain in a minute. There's the three sides all trimmed up and the reason you left that bit on the top is so you can get your knife in and peel back the top release liner about a quarter of an inch on the top and just put a crease in there and finally you can trim off top it there. Now we've got the pressure sensitive laminate onto the face of the image we now want to prepare the acrylic sheet. For this demonstration we're using a 5mm acrylic sheet 12 inch by 16 inches with diamond polished edges and four drill holes. So you need to peel back one side of the protective cover. Give it a clean. then face down onto your image. And just press down on the front edge. Now 
now we've got the acrylic prepared, we're ready to put it through the laminator and laminate it onto the back of the acrylic sheet. Gently, get hold of your release liner. Once again, give it a quick clean, just get off any dust. Peeling back the release liner as it goes. Now we've put it through the laminator and we've got the image stuck onto the back of the acrylic sheet. We're ready to trim it up on all four sides. So our flat sides trimmed up. Now we can peel back the other protective layer. We're ready to put the standoffs in. Just locate the hole. Back, put a star cut, get your standoffs, and gently screw them into the back. Same process on the three other holes. Okay, now we have the finished acrylic, all four standoffs in place, ready to be displayed.